In this video, we will prove our hyperbolic trigonometric identity, which is hyperbolic sine of 3x is equal to 3 times hyperbolic sine of x plus 4 times hyperbolic sine of cube x. So, we will take the right hand side of the identity and prove that it will be equal to the left hand side. So, the right hand side of the identity is 3 times hyperbolic sine x plus 4 times hyperbolic sine of cube x. We can write this identity as 3 times hyperbolic sine of x plus 4 times hyperbolic sine of x to the power 3. We know that hyperbolic sine of x is e to the power x minus e to the power minus x upon 2. So we have 3 times e to the power x minus e to the power minus x upon 2 plus 4 times e to the power x minus e to the power minus x upon 2 to whole power 3. Now this can be written as 3 times e to the power x minus 3 times e to the power minus x upon 2 or plus 4 times e to the power x minus e to the power minus x whole cube upon 2 to the power 3 is 8. <coughs> now we can use the formula a minus b whole cube is equal to a cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab square minus b cube for this expansion so we have 3 e to the power x minus 3 e to the power minus x upon 2 plus we can cancel 4 and 8 so that we have 2 in the denominator and we will apply this formula on this expansion so we have e to the power x cube minus 3 times e to the power x square e to the power minus x plus 3 times e to the power x times e to the power minus x square and minus e to the power minus x cube upon 2. Now we have 3 times e to the power x minus 3 times e to the power minus x upon 2 plus e to the power x cube is e to the power 3x minus 3 times e to the power x square is e to the power 2x times e to the power minus x plus 3 times e to the power x times e to the power minus x square is e to the power minus 2x minus e to the power minus x cube is e to the power minus 3x upon 2. This will be equal to 3 times e to the power x minus 3 times e to the power minus x upon 2 plus e to the power 3x minus 3 times now e to the power 2x times e to the power minus x is e to the power 2x minus x which is equal to e to the power x then plus 3 e to the power x times e to the power minus 2x is e to the power x minus 2x which is equal to e to the power minus x minus e to the power minus 3x upon 2 then we have e to the power 3 times e to the power x minus 3 times e to the power minus x plus e to the power 3x minus 3 times e to the power x plus 3 times e to the power minus x minus e to the power minus 3x upon 2. Now we can cancel 3 times e to the power x and minus 3 times e to the power x and also we can cancel minus 3 times e to the power minus x plus 3 times e to the power minus x. So we have e to the power 3x minus e to the power minus 3x upon 2 and we know that hyperbolic sine theta is equal to e to the power theta minus e to the power minus theta upon 2. So we have 3x in place of these thetas so we have the, so we will put 3x instead of this theta. So this will be equal to hyperbolic sine of 3x which was to be shown.